holy cow, guys, with this new update 1.08, there's all kinds of information that's within uh, Call of Duty Infinite Warfare Zombies. Now, what we found was that they actually released the trophies of what you can uh, actually achieve in uh, Raven of Redwoods. This is pretty early compared to actually we can't even pre-download the game yet. I know I said I was going to be able to do it Saturday, but today is Friday, and they already have the trophy guide out. All you got to do is go to your trophies, uh, scroll up to uh, Call of Duty Infinite Warfare, and then once you click on that, you'll see there's two sections. One is original, and the other one is Sabotage DLC 1. Then all you have to do is click on that, and then it'll show you the list of the trophies. So once you see the list of the trophies, the first trophy that you'll see is called Locksmith. And Raven of Redwoods recovered a piece of the Soki. So this is definitely showing that you are going to have a new Easter egg in Raven of Redwoods. That's good to know. That's actually good to see that we actually do have a new Easter egg. The second trophy that you'll see is a hidden trophy. We'll get to that. There's a way to uncover that. So the third trophy is in the Rave, Rave in the Redwoods earned 100 kills with an upgraded weapon. So that definitely shows that there is Pack-a-Punch in the, in the game, and you can definitely get to it and definitely use it. Uh, the fourth trophy is in the Rave, Wood, Rave and the Redwoods stay in the vision for five minutes. So this is the Rave vision, and you'll get a, a trophy for that. So there's got to be a way to activate that. That'll be really fun to do, fun to see what you can all see besides all the markings on the zombies and the thrasher. You'll also be able to see uh, markings on the trees, the landscape in the map, and you'll also see it on the cabin too. So let's get to the uh, hidden trophy and show you guys what that looks like. So once you click on the hidden trophy, it'll ask you to hit square, and then you hit square, and it'll show you the hidden trophy. And that one is in Raven Redwoods, Unlock Kevin Smith. So this is exciting. Just like in... Zombies in Spaceland, you can uh, open up David Hasselhoff, and this one you can actually open up Kevin Smith. So that'll be awesome to see him run around the map. He'll be like the civil protector on uh, Black Ops 3. And be, hopefully he can shoot the zombies and revive you all the same too. So that's exciting. We've got a new character in this game. Hopefully uh, they carry this throughout the theme of the zombies, and uh, we'll get new characters every DLC. So after scrolling down through the trophies, you'll see these other ones. There's a silver one which is uh, in the rave in the Redwoods, killed the slasher with his weapon. So that's really exciting. You can actually take his chainsaw from him and kill him with it. Or maybe that's one of the new weapons that you can get out of the uh, Wonder Wheel. Maybe you'll be able to do that. So that'd be fun. Uh, trophy below that is a hidden trophy. Again, you'll have to click on that, show you the hidden trophy. I'll show you the details after this little snippet. Uh, the trophy under that is Ride for Your Life. And Raven Redwoods ride every zip line. So it looks like there's more than one zip line. I know we saw one zip line in the uh, preview trailer, but maybe it's like Zetsubu and uh, Black Ops. You'll be able to ride more than one. And the next trophy you see is in Raven Redwoods, complete your photo collection. So it looks like it has a sticker collection, just like Zombies in Spaceland. There'll be different sorts that you have to do for that, unlock different achievements, uh, put it towards, I'm um, assuming, towards the Easter egg and different uh, buildables for like weapons and different stuff like that. Just like in Zombies in Spaceland, you could open up those wonder weapons. So that's really exciting. All right, let's talk about the hidden trophy. So here you'll see the hidden trophy is actually finding the hidden song. Just like in Zombies in Spaceland, there was hidden songs. Also Lee Ross has teased us that there is gonna be a 90s theme song for this map. So after you unlock that, you'll get a trophy. And then uh, after you scroll down after that, you'll be able to look at the different trophies uh, the remaining two trophies are Pump It Up and Raven of Redwoods, Pack a Puncher Weapon. Just like I said, you'll be able to pack a puncher weapon in Raven of Redwoods. There's another trophy similar to that. You can scroll back up and see what that was. And the final trophy that you can open up is Top Camper and Raven of Redwoods earn all camp badges. So that's I think that goes towards the challenges that we were teased that we were going to uh, do. Instead of doing the ticket saying there's going to be challenges and you're going to be able to unlock different weapons and whatnot for that so that'd be exciting to do uh be exciting to see what weapons we get it'll be fun attacking uh the zombies with more melee hopefully they're stronger than uh regular melee weapons that we're used to so that'd be fun uh interesting to find out i can't wait for this dlc to come out and actually play it we're gonna have a lot of fun please stay tuned to this channel and you'll be able to see everything that we do all right guys i hope you guys like this video please subscribe if you're new Smash that like button like a fat kid loves cake. And until the next video, I will see you guys later.